Eliminating duplicate copies of photos is a frequently discussed topic among memory keepers. In this tutorial, I'm sharing a step-by-step -step duplicate elimination process that works for both PC and Mac users. If your photos are in multiple locations and spread across numerous devices and drives, this simple process can help you identify duplicate copies. With intentional action, you can consolidate your photo library and stop worrying about your memories getting lost in the clutter. Let's get started. The first step is to designate a folder as your photo home or master photo library. Then create nested chronological folders designated with years and months. If you have a particular subset of your photos that's in the best shape, you can move just that subset into this folder structure. And if you don't, that's okay too. This is your starting point, your photo home. It may be imperfect and incomplete, but that's okay. We're building from here. Next, copy all batches of images to a location near that home. For example, create a two sort folder near your master photo library. Don't worry about organization yet. Simply copy every folder from every device into this location. You can label those incoming photos by location too, such as photos from camera. So now you have a group of folders within a two sort folder. They contain photos from multiple devices and you're not sure which, if any, are already home in the master photo library. Now here's the most important part. One subfolder at a time, compare batches of photos to what's in your home. The chronological structure will help you know where each image belongs. Using large icons or preview pane can help, as can arranging your windows side by side. What you're doing is auditioning Im images for your master photo library. While this process can take some time, it is the most straightforward approach. Folder by folder, you can determine which files are duplicates and which are not. And by being clear about which location is the master, you will avoid confusion. Photos that don't exist in the master photo library can be moved into that structure. Photos that already exist in the master photo library can be flagged for deletion by appending the folder name with duplicate to delete. Your goal is to move every non-duplicate image into the master photo library and be left with a two sort folder full of subfolders flagged for deletion. With your master photo library newly organized, you can back it up in at least one location, if not two. This will leave you with the confidence to delete photos across your devices, eliminating duplicates once and for all. Going forward, new photos have a home and can be transferred into the master photo library without creating duplicate copies.